Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the minor basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawak. We will now pray the rosary. Please kneel. A sacred feast in which, in we, which we part of Christ's Christ sufferings, sufferings are remembered. remembered. Our minds are filled with his grace, grace and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You give the bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contains all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you, you gave us your grace as a memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help, help us to experience salvation you want for us. us. At the peace, At the peace of, the of the kingdom, we are you with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be done un unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech, we beseech you, O Lord, Lord your, your grace into our hearts, hearts that, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your Son, Son was, was made known by the message of an angel. angel. May, May by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the, the same Christ, Christ our Lord. Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on five sorrowful mysteries. The first sorrowful mystery, agony in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thrones. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners and will be forever. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us 
and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day of our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as you forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God, God despise not our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by, by his, his life, life, death, and, and resurrection, has purchased, purchased for us the rewards of eternal, eternal life, grant we beseech you that, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed, Blessed Virgin, Virgin Mary, Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has sent over his household, the Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed with him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrust our Savior, Savior to the, the care of Saint, Saint Joseph. Saint Joseph. By, By the help, help of his prayers, may your may church, church continue to serve the Lord Jesus Christ, Christ who lives and, and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, Spirit God, God forever and ever. And ever. Amen. Amen. Jubilee Prayer O God, our Father and Creator, in whom, whom we, live we live and move and, move and have our being, we praise you as, as we gather, gather in gentle grace and gratitude, and gratitude on this jubilee of the, of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O oh God, the Son, our Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ we preach you as the way and the truth and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose life we strive to incarnate. O oh God, the Holy Spirit, and us all, in the gospel we share with all peoples, by your, By your will, will, O God, God in, in your, your name, name, O Lord. Lord. Amen. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is Friday in the 18th week of Ordinary Time and the Memorial of Dedication of St. Mary Major. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of Mary. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, Christ the, the Son of, of Mary. Mary. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the Rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, Christ the, the Son of Mary. Mary. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea it belongs to Him, the dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, Christ the, the Son of Mary. Mary. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God and we are His people, the flock His shepherds. Come, Come, let, let us, us worship, worship Christ, Christ, the Son, Son of Mary. Mary. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa, 
they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, let, let us worship Christ, the Son of Mary. Mary. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, Christ the, Son the Son of Mary. Mary. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, Christ the, Son the Son of Mary. Mary. Please be seated. A humble, contrite heart, O God, you will not spurn. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, black out my offense. O wash me more and more from my guilt, and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly, I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone, have I sinned. What is evil in your sight, I have done that you may be justified when you give sentence and be without reproach when you judge. O oh, see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed you love truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God. Put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your heart. Help. With the spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O rescue me, God, my helper and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight. Burnt offerings for me you would refuse. May sacrifice a contrite spirit, a humbled, contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness show favor to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocaust offered on your altar. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Great are the heavens with His glory, and with His praise the earth is filled. His splendor spreads like the light. Rays shine forth from beside Him. Where His powers is concealed, you come forth to save your people, to save your anointed one. You tread the sea with your steeds amid the churning of the deep waters. I hear and my body trembles at the sound of my lips quiver. Decay invades my bones. My legs tremble beneath me. I await the day of distress that will come upon the people who attack us. For though the fig tree blossom not, nor fruit on the vines, though the yield of the vine, of the olive fail, and the terraces produce no nourishment, Though the flock dispel from the fold, and there be no hurt in the stones, yet will I rejoice in the Lord, and exult in my saving God. God my Lord is my strength. He makes my feet swift as those of hands, enables me to go upon the heights. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh, praise the Lord, Jerusalem. O oh, praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Zion, praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed the children within you. He established peace on your borders. He feeds you with finest sweet. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as wool. He scatters hoar frost like ashes. He hurls down hailstones like crumbs. The waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word and it melts them. At the bend of his mouth, the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob, to Israel his loss and decrease. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. 
as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Today we uh, celebrate in a special way the dedication of the Basilica of St. Mary Major. I said in a special way because we as a shrine have been um, affiliated to, to the Basilica of St. Mary Major as a minor basilica. So it's a very special celebration for us today. Let us pray. Pardon the faults of your servants, we pray, O Lord, that we who cannot please you by our own deeds may be saved through the intercession of the mother of your Son and our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of the prophet Nahum. See, upon the mountains there, at fences, the bearer God will restore the vine of Jacob, the pride of Israel, though ravagers have ravaged them, and full of plunder, whose saluting never stops. The crack of the whip, the rumbling sounds of wheels, horses a gallop, chariots bounding, cavalry charging, the flame of the sword, the flash of the spear, the man is slain, the heaping corpse, the endless bodies, can one find any to console her? The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. It is I who will deal death and give life. It is I who deal death and give life. Close at hand is the day of their disaster, and their doom is rushing upon them. Surely the Lord shall do justice for his people. On his servants he shall have pity. It is I who deal death and give life. Learn that I, I alone, am God, and there is no God besides me. It is I who bring both death and life, I who inflict wounds and heal them. It is I who deal death and give life. I will sharpen my flashing sword, and my hand shall lay hold of my quiver. With vengeance I will repay my vows and requite those who hate me. It is I who deal death and give life. Please stand. Alleluia. Alleluia. Blessed are they who are persecuted for the sake of righteousness. For theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Whoever wishes to come after me must deny himself, take up his cross, and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it. But whoever loses his life for my sake will find it. What profit would there be for one to gain the whole world and forfeit his life? Or what can one give in exchange for his life? For the Son of Man will come with his angels in his Father's glory, 
and then he will repay each according to his conduct. Amen, I say to you. There are some standing here who will not taste death until they see the Son of Man coming in his kingdom. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Welcome, my dear brothers and sisters, to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawan. Today's Gospel narrative tells us about what it truly means to become a Christian. What it truly means to become a Christian, a follower of Christ. So ano pong ibig sabihin paging isang Kristiyano? Pero po, first, kailangan muna natin malaman anong konteksto ang ating ibanghelyo ng ngayong araw. We need to understand the context of the gospel narrative that we have just read this morning. So our gospel narrative of today actually is a continuation of the gospel reading of yesterday. Kung nag po kayo ng misa kahapon, so you would know that yesterday's gospel talk about Peter's confession of faith on Jesus as Messiah. Pero, itong gospel narrative of today also is a continuation, is a prefiguration, rather, or anticipation of very important event in the gospel, in the New Testament, which we'll celebrate tomorrow. Transfiguration. So ngayon, we have three parts. First, is the gospel reading of yesterday. Second, itong instruction given by Christ to his disciples on the meaning, the true meaning of Christian discipleship. And the third part is the transfiguration. Bakit po transfiguration dito po binanggit sa last part or last verse ng ating Ibanghelyo. Amen, I say to you, there are some standing here who will not taste death until they see the Son of Man coming in His kingdom. Sa mga Bible scholars, sabi nila, this verse would refer to the immediate event following this discourse of Jesus. Ano po yan? Yung transfiguration. So after six days, chapter 17 of the same gospel, gospel of Matthew, We'll talk about transfiguration. So now we have three parts. Yesterday's gospel, today's gospel, and tomorrow's gospel. So yesterday's gospel, Peter said, confessing his faith, you are Christ, the son of the living God. You are Christ, the son of the living God. Pero unfortunately, immediately, Peter refused to admit the suffering that Christ, his Lord, his Master, will have to endure on the cross. So after saying that you are the Christ, the Son of the living God, and Peter immediately denied that his Master, his Lord, will have to suffer. Hindi na maintindihan ang konsepto na isang Lord, isang Master, will have to suffer. But our Lord Jesus Christ would want to press the issue here in today's gospel narrative on the true meaning of Christian discipleship. When we say you are Christ, the Son of the living God, when you say that you are a Christian, the follower of Christ, when I say I'm a Christian, the follower of Christ is not just a lip service. When I identify myself a Christian, it's not just a lip service. It bears a moral demand. It is very, very demanding. So it's not just a lip service. It bears a moral demand. 
we have to live out our identity as a Christian. So when we say, I'm a Christian, I believe that Christ is the Son of the living God, it means that I will follow Him wherever He leads me. It means to say that I will take up my cross and I will offer up my life like what He did on the cross for me. So to be a Christian means to enter into a school of love, a school of true love. And this true love is not cheap, mga kapatid. This true love demands from us our life. This true love is sacrificial. When Christ died for us, He poured out His precious blood. He is the only begotten Son of God. That kind of love is not cheap, my dear brothers and sisters. Why? Because we are not cheap ourselves. We have been created by God. When He created us, He said, It is very good. Unlike any other things, plants, animals, flowers, trees, the universe, God would only just say, It is good. But with us, he would say it is very good because He has created us uniquely. He formed us out of love. And just like the prodigal son, even though we have committed so many sins, He would still welcome us. He would still clothe us, give us the robe, our identity back as His son and daughter. And He would pour out His precious blood for us. Because His love is not cheap. We are not cheap. So my dear brothers and sisters, in today's gospel, our Lord challenges us. China challenges po tayo lahat. Regarding our idea of success, regarding our priorities, Regarding our values, wealth, fame, success, popularity, importante po yan. They are all good. When we do good things, people will appreciate us. When we have good talents, we'll be famous, yes. When we work hard, we earn a lot of money, we'll be wealthy. Pero po, all these things are just superficial. All these values in the world are not as important as the love of Christ, as Christ Himself. So we may enjoy all these things, all the blessings that we have, but Christ must be the center of our lives. We order all these things according to Christ's love for us. Because the most valuable thing and the most valuable person is Christ Himself. Higit pa sa sobra. So, china challenge po ay yung mga ideas natin of success, of wealth. And Christ is inviting us what it means to follow Him, what it means to be a Christian. So for Christ, it is very clear, as in the event of transfiguration. If we follow Him faithfully till the end, we will be granted heavenly reward. Just like Peter, James, and John, who experienced the event of transfiguration. For all of us who are faithful in following Christ, this event of transfiguration we will experience. So ngayon po, in this Eucharistic celebration, we pray, we ask the Lord, we ask the Holy Spirit, also through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary. We pray in this Mass that we may be granted perseverance, that our faith and our love 
will grow deeper and deeper, that we may be true Christians, willing to offer up our lives, to know what it means to say, You are Christ, the Son of the living God. That what is the most important and valuable thing in this life is Christ Himself. Christ, Christ Himself. Because He has loved us and because we are not cheap. His love is more than just any price, any valuable thing in this world. Please stand. My self-denial, we take up the cross each day, walking in the footsteps of our Master. Let us pray for others and so cast off the selfishness which keeps us apart from God. And after each petition we say, Almighty Father, empower us. Almighty Father, empower us. That our Pope and bishops may carry the cross of pastoral care and responsibility with selfless sacrifice, we pray. Almighty Father, empower us. That those who accepted the burden of public office may grow in the love of God through their responsible, sincere, and honest exercise of their duties. We pray. Almighty Father, empower us. That we may give wholehearted support in upholding the truth and in opposing the subtle influences of evil. We pray. Almighty Father, empower us. That those who are victims of, of oppression may finally gain justice, freedom, and peace. We pray. Almighty Father, empower us. For our brothers and ministry at St. John Lateran in Intramuros and St. Albert the Great in Calamba, we pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of this Mass, the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, We pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who suffered and died in faith may gain their heavenly reward. We pray. Almighty Father, empower us. Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, receive the prayers of a pilgrim people seeking to discover your will by walking in the footsteps of your Son who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness you have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness you have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name. 
for our good and the good of all his holy church. Receive, O Lord, we ask, the prayers of your people with the sacrificial offerings that through the intercession of Blessed Mary, the mother of your son, no petition may go unanswered, no request be made in vain, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation to praise your mighty deeds in the exaltation of all the saints and especially as we celebrate the memory of the Blessed Virgin Mary to proclaim your kindness as we echo her thankful hymn of praise. For truly, even to our sins, you have done great things and extended your abundant mercy from age to age. When you looked on the lowliness of your handmaid, you gave us through her, the author of our salvation, your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Through him, the host of angels adores your majesty and rejoices in your presence forever. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in one chorus of exultant praise as we acclaim. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Sakus mo at pagkabuhay, kami na tukos mong tuhan. O Jesus, namin mahal, ilikas mo kami ng tanan. O Jesus, namin mahal, ngayon at 
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, and Socrates, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that through the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Let us pray now to our Father in heaven in the words that our Lord himself has taught us. Us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who we'll live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. 
Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. This is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this banquet. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. Kaunti lang pong instructions bago tayo mag-communion para sa mga ano, para mag-ayos. Bago tayo lumapit sa pila, baba na natin yung mask natin para hindi na tayo nag-fumble na, as we come to the, to receive the blessed sack, to, to receive the Eucharist. Tapos, pagkatanggap na pagkatanggap natin sana ng body of Christ, dahil yan body of Christ, we step aside and then receive it already, consume it. Huwag na huwag nating dadalhin sa ating upuan at huwag na rin natin ihahatian yung ating mga anak. So, yan ay para sa atin lang. Okay? So, consume it right away and do not bring it to your seats or anywhere else. Holy Mary, ever virgin, mother of God, blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. 
This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight, all the days of our life. You, my, my child, child shall be called the prophet of the Most High, High for you, you will go before, before the Lord to prepare, to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary ever-Virgin, Mother of God, God blessed are you among women, women, and blessed, blessed is the fruit, fruit of your womb. Let us pray. As we receive this heavenly sacrament, we beseech, O Lord, your mercy, that we who rejoice in commemorating the Blessed Virgin Mary may, by imitating her, serve worthily the mystery of our redemption. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat sa pakikisa sa Santa Misa. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. We now pray for the sick and bless your religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary. May all these articles be blessed and those who use them made holy as they fulfill the will of God according to the example of the Blessed Mother. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.